August 5th, 2023, and this video is called Common Milkweed is Invasive. Now, this is the common milkweed. The uh, botanical name is Asclepia syriaca. And they're promoting it to help the monarch butterflies which that's what the monarchs will eat and lay their eggs on this. Now there's over a hundred species of milkweed. Now this is the one that's pretty invasive. So you gotta watch out when you plant it. It's definitely a pollinator attractor. And what's cool is once the caterpillars of the monarch butterfly they eat the leaves and the sap is toxic so like birds won't eat the butterflies because they know they're toxic they don't taste good and they leave them alone but what's cool is there's a one a butterfly that mimics the monarch and it's a viceroy and so the predators, birds, and other insects leave it alone because they think it's a monarch. Pretty smart. It smells sweet from the nectar on this thing. Let me show you. Here's uh, up over in here. Now here are the uh, seed pods. They're going to split open later and they're just going to start blowing all over the place. Now let me show you what happens when you pull it out of the ground. It comes right back. These guys right here. That's why because you can't get to the bottom of those uh, roots. And then they end up just coming back. So I'm going to show you a patch in three years, how it just took over. And if you don't watch it, it'll take over your whole yard, which some people might want. But I'm just giving you a warning that this common milkweed is very invasive. See, I, I picked it about a month ago and look at it, it just comes right back. It's indestructible actually so if you got areas where it could just roam free be my guest and plant it but beware that this stuff is invasive now this is the patch that it only took three years to grow out of hand like this and I gotta do something because this is just gonna take over a whole bed but this is probably about 15 square feet within three years it's just solid and actually those things are probably pushing about six feet tall, seven to eight foot tall. And look at this bed. Within three years, it's just a solid mass of milkweed. This is the soil that it was in, so it's kind of loose and friable. See how it just comes apart? Very organic. But I tried pulling a couple of these guys out, and this is what you're going to be dealing with. This is how it goes underground here. So here's one stock, pretty thick, and you can see how it cuts across then. And then look at this one. This one had four stems on it, and you could see that the roots end up going in every direction to keep growing and spreading. So, I don't even know how you'd be able to get rid of this. I hate to use the word Roundup, but you cannot sp spray it when it's this tall because it'll get on everything. So what you do is you pull this out of the ground, and when those little rosettes come up out of the ground, that's when you're going to have to spray it. Other than that, I cannot see how you can get rid of this uh, invasive plant. So that's just a heads up, be careful uh, planting it, because once it's in, 
I doubt you'll ever get it out.